What's up guys? Friday afternoon, I'm eating a little lunch. I got this delicious situation of broccoli, grilled chicken, and a little salad with a tiny bit of house dressing, which is super fatty, but it's so good. Uh, I'm gonna eat this, probably gonna go um, do some sort of exercise, could be running, could be basketball, could be gym, not sure. Then I don't know what's even planned for tonight. It's Friday night, I'm extremely tired. Might go out, might stay in, we'll see what happens. And uh, yeah, happy Friday. Eating healthy rules. Where did I put my basketball shit? The respectable way to cut your sleeves off a shirt. Cut off the tag, of course. My town, Reading, Mass, is like a utopia. Everyone's just happy and going about their day. It's very easy to drive here. All I do is pretty much like sit in my car and just wave people along. Like everyone that turns in front of me, I like wave them along. We're having an impromptu three point contest. So I haven't been playing too well at basketball. I can tell why, it's because my lifting has not been there. I've played a lot of basketball recently, I've ran a lot, but I haven't lifted at all. And uh, I can tell it's hurting my game, so I'm gonna start lifting again. Pineapples make it so sweet. Mm. Probably slightly higher in sugar than you might want. But there's a lot of fiber in the kale and um, you get some carbs from the banana and there's basically zero fat. So it's great on macros, good on micros. The best advice I ever got about nutrition was when I was 18 years old. We had this trainer that was brought in to train our basketball team 
and he was the same trainer that had trained David Ortiz, who's a Boston Red Sox player. And what he told us was the best, simplest way to improve your nutrition is just to cut out all sugar, period. Look up everything you eat, and if there's any sugar content, out. Now you can eat a small amount of sugar, so if there's a small amount of sugar in something that's high volume and very low sugar, that's fine. But anything that's low volume and high sugar, you don't want that food. But everyone has their own diets. Everyone has different things that work for them. Everyone has different priorities, so just something to consider. Today's word of the day is effusive. Effusive. Unrestrained or excessive in emotional expression. When Draymond Green hit the three-pointer on the opposing team's floor, his celebration was effusive. I caved again. Got sushi. I'm going to eat this, finish the edit, go to bed. See you tomorrow. Peace.